guys welcome back to more Sanskrit Fridays this is the second video and I usually upload two videos for Sanskrit Fridays now and it's very hard for me to two, upload two videos but this is an entire discussion video and it's been quite a while Jesus guys since I did a Sanskrit Empire discussion video and really like today we'll be discussing about you know the um, cities and uh, the side quests and side missions what do you call it uh, like how it can be and how it can be improved in an empire and yeah, so let's do this So now talking about the side missions and uh, the main cities uh, First let's talk about the main cities So yeah, now the main cities in Assassin's Creed are really beautiful every city that they make is very detailed and colorful and amazing like my favorite city in a Sanskrit game is probably Venice because like obviously everybody will agree with me Venice is the best fucking setting for a Sanskrit game and just an awesome setting really and Paris was also good in Unity London was also good in Syndicate and Egypt would obviously also be good so actually I don't think so there's nothing really to talk about the main cities like the cities would be obviously good but one thing I want to talk about is that there shouldn't be loading screens on cities it should be like you know fully seamless cities and yeah the cities should be seamless and like when you just you can just walk into the city and like no loading screens and everything like in I mean in Black Flag like whenever you enter a city it was kind of a loading screen kind of thing I didn't like that there should be fully seamless cities that you just enter them and get out from there easy so yeah it should be one big area with cities in it and yeah so now talking about the side quests the side quests are also pretty much great in ubisoft games but they are a bit lacking i guess and they should be you know more kind of you know they're kind of you know part of bit of a part of a main story or should be like you know a story of their own like missions and everything like in syndicate like after you finish the game there's nothing really to do in side quests but Unity, there are a lot of stuff to do. There's Paris stories and everything, which is really great. And even Black Flag, there are loads of stuff to do. But Black Flag was kind of linear if you come to side quests. Black Flag was a bit linear. You can only do, you know, naval stuff like plundering and everything. But like, it's quite linear the side quests. But in Unity, I think it's uh, like best if you want to do side quests and everything. There are Paris stories and interesting missions. But Syndicate was a bit lacking for it. And the Empire must really should actually be like amazing with the side quests. Like it should be kind of you know its own story, the side missions. Like something happened to this guy, da, 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 and there should be parts of the mission and like kind of more like a DLC, but not that much. But yeah, it should be really great. I mean, yeah, uh, the side the cities and everything and. Uh, yeah, the side quest really, I mean, the assassination contracts especially, like, have have to be more detailed and varied. Like, you can just, you know, investigate about a target and just go in, assassinate him in different ways. Even, like, black box missions have to be great if they're returning. I have no idea if they're returning or not, but they should return because I like the concept of black, black box missions and they was very improved on it. And like the tombs in Assassin's Creed 2, like in the Etsy trilogy, obviously, the Assassin tombs should really return because really it was just so good exploring them. It really felt great, amazing exploring them. It was a nice time waste kind of thing. And it was just an awesome thing. Like there was tombs of Romulus, there was Assassin tombs in AC2, and there were a lot of tombs in the Etsy trilogy. So they must return. So yeah. So I hope you guys enjoyed this discussion video. There was nothing very much to talk about, but the side quests and side missions have to be great. And switch the cities. I haven't really have the complaints about the cities because Ubisoft makes every city they make is beautiful, and it should really be great. But this will be it for this discussion video. Like I said, you have to date. And now I'm kind of starting kind of a new feature where you can you know put what comments you put down like about you know. What discussion should I do about Sanskrit Empire? You can just put down, put it down in the comments, and I'll do those videos for you guys of me talking about the topics you want for AC Empire, like the things you want for AC Empire. 
so yeah so yeah guys like and subscribe for like the video and i'll see you in the next video bye bye okay i sounded fucking retarded